so this is really a lot of people know how to do this a lot of people don't a lot of people use like a site that clips out art but I'm going to show you how to do this in Photoshop this works for any version of Photoshop um, you can probably also follow this with GIMP or even paint.net um, I use Photoshop personally uh, I use CS5 to cut out my art but yeah I'm just gonna show you how I mask art and you know easy ways to do it some people even do it in Vegas so um, what I do first is I make a new layer and I get a dark color I mean depending on the background so I get a darker color and I fill that in double click on the first layer to unlock it so I can you know move it around um, the reason I put the dark color there is when you um, delete the background it's a bunch of white squares and it's hard to actually see if you've got everything so we're gonna do that now what I do is I use the magic wand tool um, and I have it set to anti-alias uh, contiguous I believe that's how you say it <laughs> and 23 tolerance I turn it up and down as needed so I'm just gonna select all the white areas and then once I'm satisfied with that what I do is I go to refine edge make sure I got everything that I want hit ok and then I hit delete now you see how there's still some little crusty bits around the edges of it? Well, what we're gonna do is you're gonna go over to the, the, the movie slidey move it around tool in your program of choice. Now this is where I don't know how to do this with other programs. I hit control A and it gives you like, see how it changes the cursor to little scissors? Click on it, drag it, and get the selection around it, it's kind of like you know cuts it out basically so now I go to refine edge again and I shift the edge inward I'm just scrolling it and then I turn the smoothing up just a tiny bit and it gets rid of those you know nasty that nasty like outer edging of pixels so to delete that I go to select inverse and hit delete and there we go now for little things like see how her hair is like that I just zoom in and I grab the polygonal lasso tool and I will just go in and fix up any stray areas I just grab them all at once and then delete them once I've grabbed them all and basically I'll just go around the whole picture and do this you know just slide around make sure I get everything uh, you don't have to be this precise but if you put the mask on back a black backdrop you're gonna see it in the video it's just a fact of life I'm gonna cut these little lines out because they're kind of weird and they were kind of you know blurred by that. Now you can also, again, you can just do this manually in Vegas with the masking tool, and I know a lot of this can be done in other programs, but this was just a Photoshop specific tutor tutorial. Then I delete those. I probably missed some bits, but you know, those are just very small little tidbits. And get rid of that, and there you go. Um, that is how I mask things.